A recent survey of 119 medical textbooks showed that information on chronic fatigue syndrome or myalgic encephalomyelitis was presented on just 0.9% of the textbook pages. It showed that the illness is significantly underrepresented in medical textbooks compared with diseases that are much less prevalent, such as Lyme disease and multiple sclerosis. For a million Americans and 20 million people worldwide, being told by their doctors, I didn't hear about it in medical school, just won't cut it. That's why we're setting out to do something about it. We're proposing a fellowship for 10 medical students to work for eight to 10 weeks at 10 of the premier ME CFS institutes in the world. They will study one of the most devastating and overlooked diseases of modern times. It's an opportunity to jump in and help some of the most underserved patients in all of medicine. But even more than that, these fellows will get a crucial introduction to some of the methods and technologies that are transforming the future of medicine. Molecular biology, gene expression, big data, and translational medicine. I am enjoying it a lot. I mean, I'm learning a ton. He kind of gave me like the broad perspective of what it is, and I was taking an immunology class at the time, mm -hmm. so that was nice to kind of make those connecting dots. I hope I answered yeah, that correctly. Per I'm exactly still right. studying all this. <laughs> I really didn't understand it until I came to the Neuroimmunology Clinic here at Nova and uh, learned by watching the doctors treat and work with the patients that each patient is very delicate. The Blue Ribbon Foundation is proud to partner with a range of stakeholders across the ME, CFS, and a wider neuroimmune research community. Our mission, to foster an international dialogue that can lead to finding the cause, cure, and prevention of neuroimmune diseases.